Hi uh, YouTube, <clears throat> Edward Tindall and Sarah Tindall here. Trying to adjust the camera for macro mode filming. We are trying to feed the wild caught imported. Mm. This voracious beast here. I put macro mode so I can show you guys and gals her absolute beauty. This is a female. And you can see the shape that she's in. She, I think she had a missing tail at some point, the way it looks like that. See that growth spot right there? We put her in here hours ago with a super worm. One, two, three, and two and a half, I should say. Rusty reds and one dubia. And, well, that was it. became a half with her. So I was trying to hold it and feed it to her. She's very not wanting to eat. Yeah, I would say that tail has been broken before. You can see the different color. Let me get up closer. You can see the little second band right there. I've never had turkeys on my channel before. If any of y'all have any ideas about what would get this gal eating. Keep in mind she's wild caught. Don't let me know. Try to pet her a little bit. Oh, she's actually letting me pet her now. That's new. Well, she was being mean when I was putting her. Oh, no, she's picking too. <laughs> she, she was being really, really mean. Sarah was laughing like crazy earlier. Let me see. I'm gonna put a finger down here and just barely touch her tail. Oh, nope. Let's see if I can get her to talk. She's talking. She's really fast. Thank you, baby. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Trying to be nice with her. Okay, sweetheart. I don't think she knows what. Oh. A little bit of talk right there. And if y'all know, let me know. She would like to eat. What would help her eat? I don't. I put a roach up to her mouth and made her bite it. That was this one with a pair of tweezers. But I don't want. She didn't want to spit it out. Could be that she's not hungry. It's a possibility. Um, I have her housed in this temporary. I'm going to get her a bigger enclosure eventually. But for now. Look at that mouth. Ooh. Ow! <laughs> she just got me. Again. <laughs> and we're not doing this for Oops. everybody's pleasure. No, I'm not we're getting We're trying bit. to calm her down. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I'm trying to calm her down and get her eating. Um, she is a little bit faster than I am. Check out them toes. Beautiful toes. So the Tokyo Gecko female, and everybody just rants and raves how they are the most notorious eaters of all time. And I grew up with these when I was a kid. I've never really kept them, but they were all over wild, so I played with them and stuff and aggravated them as a child to hear them bark. But uh, I never tried to keep them in captivity, so I don't really know. Quit being so mean. Let, let me don't jump at me. Let me let me do something. Hey, don't do that. Hey, ooh, it's sad. I'm a tender loop. Don't fuck with me, bitch. I won't fuck with you. <laughs> She's so so not. You're being not cool. Don't be not cool. She her eyes are on me, it's like, if you come at me, I'm going to get, I'm going to touch the tip of her tail, I think, 
just the very tip. And she's okay with that for right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I want her to be nice and okay with everything. I don't even know if you can tame a wild one down like that. Whoa, 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 it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. I'm not really worried about her biting me, although she's got some teeth and she's shredded that finger up a little bit. I am worried about her hurting herself. Someone I know had one of these bite them on the arm while they were working with them, and it bit down so hard on his forearm that it killed the gecko from a heart attack or something. It's really uh, not cool. It's okay, baby. It's okay. If I can let, if I can let her know that I'm not a threat. She's so cool and primitive looking. And I wonder. It's like a living dinosaur kind of. I wonder if dinosaurs were colored like this. It's very possible. To got them claws. She seems to know that the camera is something that's not real or something she don't want to bite, but she clearly knows the difference in my finger. So I can get the camera in her face and she's fine. If I put this finger up there just a little bit, she's like... <laughs> she, she never struck at the camera not one time. I wonder if they got some kind of heat sensor or something. It's okay, sweetie. It's okay. You're not going to let me pet you. And like I said, we do like to take animals and kids come over here to see. Can't let a kid pet this one, though. No, but we want to kind of get it socialized a little bit before we start letting kids. And kid at eating. Um, come and spend time and if they want to touch it we want them where we know they're not going to be bitey and this might be one that they can only look at but not touch I would think so it's pretty aggressive pretty dangerous it's like a little it's like a full grown mean rabbit alligator <laughs> if there was such a thing but we do like to bring animals here and show them some Everything from sunshine, that is our retakes that we allow to come out and the kids to see them. Whoa, whoa, whoa baby, whoa baby. <laughs> Look at Sarah, if y'all can see this, she's shielding. <laughs> because I don't want to get bit tonight. I want to get loose in there either. Whoa, whoa. What's happening? She can, anything she touches, anything she touches is clean. She can clean the cardboard or anything. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, don't. I'm not. Not. <laughs> Focus for get you. <laughs> Hold on, I just wanted to grab you. Let me grab you. Come here. Don't. Don't attack at me. Come here. Don't. <laughs> I'm just gonna get you. Let me get you, please. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just. Oh! I'm just gonna grab this thing a little bit. You're alright, mate. You're alright. Don't make me manhandle you. Whoa! Oh! Gecko chase. I'm gonna have to take one. I'm gonna have to take one on the team. Hey, what are you talking? It's okay, baby. I'm not hurting her. She's just making this. Maybe she needs. That's how she communicates. <laughs> what are you doing, sir? She just flew out. Do you really want her to fly out again? I don't know. Maybe you get her to eat that way. No. She knows what I'm trying to get her to eat. I don't know. All right, look. 
Maybe she'll calm down because I'm holding. Whoa, maybe not. <laughs> Y'all let me know <laughs> what to do with this baby girl. They're jumpers. It's funny how they act like they just jump and lunge and bite. They know their bite's bad. It's okay. It's okay. Hey, I don't want to. I don't want to harm you at all. I just. Just want some lizard love or something. <laughs> All right. And I can already hear it in the comments. You're being aggressive towards that gecko. Who's Lizards. being aggressive towards the gecko? Look at that gecko towards me. Hey, 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 hey. You're alright, you're alright. You're stressing it out. Yeah, probably. But here's the question. It's kind of a stressful situation myself. I'm trying to... You have to earn your trust with nice. your animals. Mm -hmm. If you don't earn that trust... It is possible to tame down geckos. You're okay. You're okay. Got a big flat surface here. Maybe she's not... She likes... She likes biting little... She likes <laughs> biting little uh, fingers and stuff. So she can get a hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa mama. I'm sorry. Alright, y'all just enjoy the beauty of this animal. Leave in the comments below what you think if you have experience with wild caught adult uh, Tokyo geckos. Let me know what you think. She's been cohab since I got back from the show with roaches and millworms not too many to stress her out but enough that if she wanted to eat something she could and she did not so i decided to move her to this other enclosure and i will put her back in her other enclosure and we after this video a name for this beautiful girl you guys should be a lovely guest do 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 do. I'm loving it. And it is going to be Marie. Whoops. Marie Webster. Since it is a female from Peter Webster from YouTube. His lovely wife. Mm hmm. I thought we were going to tell him the next video. That's fine. Um. We want. Since it is a female, we did want to do something special, and we have been talking about naming something after Peter. And since I don't have a male tokay, then this one was going to be named after his wife. You have to catch it in a certain way because the dog is going to catch me, and that's not cool for me or for the animal. All right, all right. I'm not hurting it. I'm not hurting it. I'm not hurting it. I'm not hurting it. I'm not constraining it really much. Just enough where she don't bite me. I'm going to put her back in her cage. That is a small cage for now, but... I'll give her a little bit more room later. Not too long from now. We're just rearranging stuff right now and everything. I hope you guys enjoyed her. Marie Webster, everyone. Ran out of labels, so... Right now, she's just Skullopendra. Faded Skullopendra. Then soon to be Marie Webster. <laughs> Edward Tendall. Sorry, Peter! Yeah, everybody likes to see that beautiful blue eye. I don't know what mine is right now. All Sorry, right, Peter. I went, it, went to a, to hurt your feelings and name one of our animals. That's a female after you, but I want to do something special for you and your family, so we wanted to name it Marie after your wife. So definitely leave in the comments below go all the things you would do. Channel. All the things you would do to make sure Marie has a long, fruitful, happy, healthy life. Edward Tindall and Sarah Tindall out.